you're just gonna die in the end. <laughs> Girls tend to get creeped out a little bit when you do that. I mean, I think I, I wouldn't know. Oh. Wasn't what it sounded like. <laughs> doo -doo -doo. Uh, that, that little blue bell there, that doo -doo -doo, that's so freaking cute. <laughs> I love CRT TVs. <laughs> Comedy skit. <laughs> what the fuck is going on now? Proof. So she's she's experiencing the time glitches as well. What the fuck is going on? Now here's Miss No Time Travel. Kurisu. All right, did that? <coughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry, guys. The intrigue level just picked up a bunch for me. Get it? A bunch? Because it was bananas and then... Come on, that's funny stuff. Our, so at least... <clears throat> excuse me. To my memory, what we had been seeing so far was basic time travel stuff. Or time skips, whatever the case may be. But now, how did you go back in time to have the banana back on the bunch... But forward in time to have it already been through the microwave. That's pretty fucking cool. I, I like that angle. <laughs> A sea bear. Another SpongeBob reference. Look at the sea bear on the right. Gotta draw a circle. Racist. Or speciesist. No way, stupid. <laughs> I look so well. <laughs> are these chicks? <laughs> Come on, Sanji. Be strong, bro. Keep that blood inside the nose. There you go, Sanji. Nirvana has arrived. Who's the boss? There we fucking go. That's because you know what I've been I've been concerned with because we never really saw the eventuality of our if that fucking Arlong is alive, somebody needs to cut his fucking head off. But in any event, it looks like the uh the straw hats wherever they go, I think from now on are always gonna have a reputation that precedes them, so there's always going to be somebody looking to make a point at their expense. And Sanji is... Uh, the, the, the dream of the all blue has not been realized yet, and at some point he'll get to that, but goddamn, this, this is a really good holdover until you can get there. I can't help it if you're vertically challenged. Bitch. Stop Bitch. Something. Wow. This is rough. Oh, look at those beauties. Sorry about that. God damn, what Belle. What is your name? If I may ask. <laughs> Shouldn't touch, bitch. Stop. Keep your goddamn Slashing hands, pins, whatever the fuck that was right to yourself. My eyes. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think they were gonna stay away for long. <laughs> God damn. Now what? Oh, so this is... My mistake. 
I should have considered what you might do with all this extra power. Need nothing. So I'm cutting my losses. <laughs> he called her a loss. This isn't what he I just expected. cut her. <laughs> I went through a considerable amount of effort to gather all of you Espadas. Please Members kill him. Of the 13 court guard squads. And you failed Maka Rankars. Oh, we're really gonna get down to it now, aren't we? Let's get it on. Yikes. Uh, again, every episode, they're able to make me hate this fucker a little bit more. And the thing that just came to mind, though, is at some point... Well, I, I would think at some point, we're going to have to see out of control Ichigo and Aizen at each other, aren't we? I don't know, but yeah, it's it's interesting that somebody as obnoxious and smug as Gein can make me like elements of him. There are moments where it's like he makes me laugh, and there's just absolutely none of that with Aizen. That was a cool story of Bell too. What a horrible, despicable way for it to end. <laughs> 